can't believe I managed to stumble through more than 700 videos. Never made a video on this one, the M5. And I get a lot of emails, about 20 a month, saying, pick the M5, pick the M5. But you know, it's at the point now where I really don't want to give Master Lock any more of my good money for their bad locks. But here you go, I was out jogging, found this, it apparently it was hanging on a work truck, and I found it just past a speed bump. So apparently it hit, hit, hit the bump, the thing came off, and you can see it's pretty beat up. Some cars have been running over this thing, and the other side is really bad. This was the side against the pavement, so it's pretty jacked up. So I don't have any clue. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and lock it. There's nothing we can do with it, so I might as well lock it. So even if the internals are damaged, it doesn't matter. We'll just throw it away. We couldn't repair it anyway. So anyway, for those of you who've been asking about this, this is a standard four-pin lock, despite its rather intimidating-looking appearance and that weird-sized shackle that says boron, if I can get that to focus for us. It looks like it's something special, but it's still that same old cheap core that you find in the number threes. Anyway, take either your medium thickness, bottom of the keyway, or a thick one, and then just plop, put it right in the bottom. You can use top of the keyway, but because this guy, this guy has a little bend in him, you can still get up in there with a pick without any problem. Don't use your small one, though. That'll bind it up, and that'll make it really hard to pick. You won't really be able to tension it correctly. All right, I like to start from the back, so before I even apply any tension, I'll just stick it all the way to the rear, find that last pin, and then apply moderate to heavy tension. Master Lock's pretty sloppy tolerances, so it'll tolerate it. I don't know if you heard that. That was pin four. That felt like pin three. Pin two feels okay. Nice and solid set. Pin four, or pin one actually, got a little click out of him. And there we go. How easy is that? So, you know, their motto is tough under fire, but I think in this case tough under tires is probably more appropriate. It's, it's still a soft, creamy core. Anyway, fellas, thanks for, for your time. Stay safe, stay legal, stay away from Master Lock. Thanks, guys.